you're gonna succeed in business you cannot just be normal what makes business successful is uniqueness what makes a business successful is uniqueness what makes business successful is your uniqueness I was in Brazil a few years ago and Brazil produces leather therefore they make a lot of shoes and many of the shoes that you may buy in your stores even here in Nigeria may actually come from Brazil now when I went to Brazil they had shoe stores everywhere but a man came to me after I finished teaching and he said I own a shoe business I said really he said yes he said would you like to, to buy some of my shoes or see my shoes I said sure I will come to the store he said no dr. Monroe I have a different kind of shoe store he said I will bring it to the hotel he bought the store to the hotel it was in a beautiful box on wheels and he came and he opened this box and there were the shoes neatly laid out in this big case and he said these are genuinely made we put your name in it after you choose the one you want we put your name on it we put a little design whatever kind of logo you want we put in it he says we give personal shoe service well of course you know we had to buy some shoes this man so shoes like everybody else but it was unique and his shoe were costing up to 300 US dollars why you were not buying shoes you were buying convenience you were buying simplicity you were buying originality you were buying your own logo in other words he had an idea that was beyond just selling shoes don't just sell shirts find something that makes your shirt unique everybody sells hamburgers but they do not sell a Big Mac a Big Mac is unique they patent it I challenge you even as a minister of the gospel patent your ministry don't just preach any message find your unique message and develop it and refine it so it becomes you when you think of faith you think of David Ayedipu <laughs> when you think of healing you think of Benny Hinn when you think of Bible teaching you think of Marilyn Hickey or someone you see they develop their unique fruit they're all teachers but what they deliver is unique what is your uniqueness